Hello, 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 Lady Terry B. Jones here on today, Saturday, with What the Scriptures Say Day, where we are memorizing yeah, Galatians 5, verses 22 to 25. With, and today's scripture memorization technique is to share it, okay? So on Saturday, as you are out and about shopping, or exercising i just left my granddaughter's track meet and you may encounter someone you know that the lord leads you to you know to strike up a conversation right to ask them where they fellowshipping okay ask that and kind of share some of the things that you have are god is revealing to you as you are memorizing galatians 5 verses 22 to 25 right you strike up a conversation like yeah you know all this week you know i've been participating in uh, the scripture memorization techniques where we're taking five to 20 minutes a day to memorize scriptures and on today goodness is actually the next characteristic of the fruit of the spirit and i just want you to know you know of the that of the goodness of the lord and just let so that others can know if they don't know that god has been good to them right so they may not realize it you know because sometimes you know we take things for granted all right you know the fact that we woke up this morning the fact that we can see we can walk we can talk okay and so we have a place of employment. We have a source of income, right? And that we have family and friends. There's so many things for us to really realize that God has been good to me, right? God has been good to you, right? And so what do we do because of this goodness? We want to share it, all right? We want to share that this goodness comes from our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, okay? He is the one, you know, that died for our sins. So there's nothing that you could do that where you may feel like, you know what? You know, God, I done done too much, you know. Mm -mm, no, no, no. He, he didn't want nothing to do with me. The devil is a liar, right? No, no, no. God, there is nothing that will separate us from the love of our Savior, Jesus Christ. Okay? And so, Alan, today, as we share the the scriptures you know you you let people understand that um that god loves them that they're that they still can have joy in the midst of what they're going through th that you know they can have peace they can sleep at night they don't have to have anxiety and all of this takes place when you spend time in the word of god right meditating on the word praying according to the word believe in the word of god and realizing that the opposite of goodness is good is bad, right? That you really don't have it bad, all right? So as you spend time in that word, you'll realize, oh my God, you know, you'll repent and say, Lord, forgive me because I really got it good. You didn't realize how good you had it till you start delving into his word and he start revealing to you the goodness of the Lord, okay? And so, comment below something good that you like you know what god has been good to me i need to see what is it that you saying the lord has been so good to you about right share that in the comment all right and then and go ahead on like and subscribe those who don't have this guy go ahead on and click on the link to download it and in the meantime i want you to give someone a hug okay show someone a smile and let someone know that jesus loves them and you love them too and until tomorrow i'll come back with the next scripture memorization technique